morning, everyone. My name's Diana. This is Diana Simplifies, and there is some chainsawing going on outside. So I decided to do a little intro for Tiny Tidy Tuesday here in the house, and then I'm going to go outside and work on my front porch. Oh, there's, oh, I thought there's like something crawling on me. It's the cat. It's Fallon. Fallon, you want to say hi? Come say hi. Isn't she cute? Oh, she's a little bit scared. That's Fallon. She's got pretty green eyes. Look at everybody. You're so pretty. There you go. Okay. Yes, Neela. <clears throat> anyway, uh, it's very noisy. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to sweep my front porch and I'm going to tell you I have back issues. And so our, our front porch is massive. If you've seen any of my um, like front porch videos, I've shown the front porch. It's very large. So most likely I'm not going to do the entire porch. It's just going to kind of depend on how I feel. And when the guy redid our porch, everything's in sections. Um, it has lines down it because, you know, if there's cracks, it which there already are, it stops the crack, you know, you hope, but actually it's pretty much going all the way across again, which was why we got the porch to begin with, because we had this massive crack across our porch. So anyway, it's a smaller crack right now, but that's what those lines are for. So I just kind of use those lines as a guide, so I may just do a couple of sections, and that's also a good suggestion for all of us, whether we have energy problems, whether we have back pain, hip pain, whatever i have migraines and you know any of this kind of stuff can trigger all of that so um autoimmune issues where you just don't have the energy to do an entire porch even if your porch is small you might need to take it in sections so just a reminder to all of us we do not have to complete the entire porch in one setting one sitting one <laughs> one setting it is a setting in one sitting um, we don't have to do that okay so i'm going to do as much as i feel like I can do. And it's also, it's overcast, which is a perfect day for us to do it here. It's taken me a while to get out there at seven. It felt much better than it feels now. I walked Ranger and I got um, very, very warm, even though it's overcast because it was so humid. And I know I talk about that all the time. We are used to humidity. It's humid here all the time. It's nothing unusual. If we have a day of like 40% of humidity, we're jumping up and down because that's so unusual for us to be like at 40. It's always... 60, 70, 80, I have a feeling it, it almost feels like it's 90% today. So um, you will understand if I just kind of am like too hot and quit, you'll you'll get it. But, um, and so that's another thing between heat, you, you never want to have too much heat. You wanna make sure you're drinking plenty of water. You might need, we, at Spencer and I both drink quite a bit of Gatorade. Now, obviously if you have salt issues, you cannot, you'll, what do you, um, you'll retain too much water, but we can do that. So. You know, just keep that in mind. You need to make sure your electrolytes are okay, whatever that means for you. So we just have to be very careful about that where we live because it is so oppressive. But I thought this would be a great day to go ahead and go out there and do some sweeping. And so what I'm gonna do, because the, between the chainsawing on this end and the highway is gonna be right next to me, I'm just gonna put music over it. So I'm not gonna talk. I'm just gonna show you my broom and I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna be sweeping. That's all I'm gonna do. It's gonna be very simple, very simple. I don't, I'll see tips for sweeping your porch. I don't have one except don't kill yourself. Just do what you can. And like I said, have back pain ever since I was 16. I see a chiropractor about every two to three weeks and he keeps me straightened out. But um, sweeping is not a good thing for me. I don't enjoy it. So um, it's not something I do real often. So the porch definitely needs it. So I'm ready to get going. Thanks so much for joining me for Tiny Tidy Tuesday. Shout out to Sunday Dawn from The Helpful Home. She is our host here every single week. Thanks for joining me as always. Please subscribe if you haven't. Subscribe, like, comment, all those fun things. Definitely leave me a comment. If you have any kind of questions about anything that I'm doing ever, leave me a comment. I, I reply to everyone, okay? I, I pretty much always, unless you're leaving one of those nasty comments, I, I, and I report those, <laughs> but I always reply to comments, all right? Love you guys. See you on the porch.